What's up guys, The Lost One Gaming here and welcome to Game Dev Studio, a game where you get to start up your own game design studio and rise to the top or fail like I probably will in this game, as I always do. But let's hop into this, shall we? Start a new game. Um, none selected right now. We can do free play. Apparently it's recommended after all scenarios. I have not played any of the scenarios, but I'm just going to go with it. Just going to roll with it. I'm going to go on story mode map. Uh, we're going to start in the year 1988. Jesus, I wasn't even born then. And we're going to start with everything randomized. We're just going to see how this goes. It's bound to fail. All right. Just saying, because I have no idea what I'm doing in, at, at this point in this game. So, oh, we get to do a little bit of character design. Um, Let's see. Face type. Ew. <laughs> Ew. I'm not sure whether I necessarily like uh like my care. Can I not change my character's hair color? I can change skin color, but I can't change hair color. That's disappointing. I'm just gonna go with like classic 80s businessman look. <laughs> that's, that's just what we're doing at this point. Gla yes, nerdy glasses. I love it. <laughs> Perfect. With a beard. Yes, even though I don't even have a beard. But okay. Uh, we can put points into... 16 points. Uh, speed, overall development, time bonus, uh, vision, efficiency, and writing concept, sound management. Hmm. Maybe we should just be like really balanced. I was gonna say we could put like five into each, but that wouldn't. We could put four into each, right? I think that's a. I think we just want to be a balanced guy. I think that's probably the best that we can do at this point. I don't want to be like super good at like anything. I just want to be balanced. Uh, traits. We can pick a trait. Hyper. Uh, 10% more issues. Ooh, these sounds like each one of these has a, uh, has a, what, what's the word I'm looking for? They have a caveat to them, pretty much. Can handle anything PR related. Uh, that's not really. Maybe bug magnet? 10%, mmm, 10. Should we just not have traits right now? I feel like all these would be kind of bad. Except for maybe silver tongue. That one might be okay. Uh, I think we'll just keep silver tongue and that's it. Interest, uh, hunting, what the frick, this is all in here too? Uh, machine learning. Uh, sure, let's do that. Let's also do, yes, I'm a freaking computer engineer that's interested in parkour. <laughs> and guns. Now we'll do, um, public speaking, even though I don't like speaking in public. So I guess we're, uh, this is all just, we start out at level 20, I guess, and everything. So let's go ahead and start now. I'm happy with my character and everything that he is supposed to be. I didn't pick a name. So I don't know if my character has a name at all. Um, enter studio name. As always, we will call it Lost Something. So it's just going to be called Lost, Lost Studios. Alright. Too bad it's not like a movie industry though. That would make way more sense. But I guess we're start. Are you sure you want to use this company name? You won't be able to change the name of your company later. Yep, this is like a lot of companies. You uh, make a name for yourself and then you regret that name. Alright, I'm happy with what we're doing. So what the frick is going on? Player's not been assigned to a workspace. Is everything just kind of happening right now? We're starting out with 400k. Um, let's see what we can do. Player's not been... Yes, I know. I'm aware that I have not assigned anything. Okay, now this is where it starts to... Projects. Uh, record. Oh god, what is going on? <laughs> I have no idea what to do. View all your... Oh, record. I thought they said record. Platform. So there's the... The MEM. It's market share of 16%. The op... What the frick are these things? PC has a 51% market share. License cost of zero. So it's probably best for me to start out releasing PC games. Especially because the market's bigger and the license cost isn't as much. So let's just do... Wait a minute. It says no... No options. Oh, I already have them. Okay, uh, hmm, how should we go about this? I need to build a desk or something, right? Property and rivals, projects, employees, office preferences. Uh, auto raise, auto approve raise, no, none of that really is what I'm looking for. Property and rivals, uh, expand office, assign employees, assign character, uh, <laughs> I don't, let's see. Player character in a assigned player assigning player character. I don't think I'm actually doing anything. There's no workspace here. Where's my building? <laughs> this is why I should have played the tutorial, because then I'd actually know what I was doing right now. Alright, so after fiddling around for a little bit, I actually finally found out how to actually put down the workplace. It was uh, in the uh 
not the projects part that's not even where it was i i can't even where was it again god dang it now i've lost it again property and rivals and then they expand office and it's down in the uh that part the office area so now i know what i'm doing somewhat i only need one desk though because i only have one employee which is myself at this point so i'm gonna go ahead and assign my employee to the desk uh now let's see what we got um point management activities i still okay i can assign him now how do i I'm assigning. Workplace requires a light level of two. Oh, I have to put up lights and every. Oh, uh, <laughs> that's annoying. All right, which should be in the same office expansion thing. So let's go ahead and get this office, I guess, up and running. Uh, lamp plus six to electricity bills a month. Door. I mean, we don't have any rooms. There's really, really no need for any of that. Are we just putting the lamp on the floor at this point? I mean, I guess. Ew, that's sound. I guess that. I guess that's okay. We'll just put four in there just in case we need it. And there's my character. Sitting there all by his lonesome doing absolutely nothing right now because the game is paused. Well, let's go ahead and start on a new game. I think it says something about the the post-apocalyptic thing is trending. We're going to be trendsetter slash trend jumper at this point, I guess. So let's see what we want to do. We want to we want to make this uh, simulation sandbox design new we could make a whole entire new genre uh we actually can't are we not able to do the other genre yet uh hmm. urban steampunk hmm i don't know if i like any of these let's do teen we'll do it on you must select an engine do we even have an engine you currently oh god we have to develop an engine too oh no <laughs> All right, let, let's start. We got to start from the very beginning, okay? I think we got to start from the very beginning. Uh, new engine, select team, just the studio team, whatever. 2D projection, uh, single channel audio, dynamic music. We'll just put everything that we can in here. Uh, and we'll just call it Symbios or something. I don't know. That That's fine, I guess. So how long is this going to take? Total work amount, 200 software points. Uh, well, we don't have any other... Wait, do we have an engine already in place? We do not. Okay, so we're just gonna go ahead and do that. Create a game engine. We gotta start somewhere, alright? So let's go ahead and get this going. I have no... Office 1 can use more restrooms. Man, do we really need restrooms? Platform popularity boost. Pineapple has announced... Pineapple? Who the frick is Pineapple? Has announced some policy changes for their Abacoxy uh, SC platform, which were met with met positively by gamers all around the world. An increase in popularity platform is expected. Uh, so the Abacoxy is supposed to see some uh, increases, but we're mainly focusing on PC right now. All these other these other fads, they're going to come and go. <laughs> Mint Mendo, I know who that's supposed to be, Nintendo, has recently begun heavy marketing for their MEM platform. Uh, an increase in popularity platform is expected. Uh, let's see. It's still talking about restrooms, so do I actually need to put that in there? I got a feeling I may actually have to do that. Uh, expand office. It will cost me 2500 to do... How much is like... How do I put a bathroom in here? Can I just throw the bathroom in the corner? Like, is that a thing? Can I put up walls? I can. Wait, no. That's... There's a wall. Plaster wall. All these are the same. Plaster wall or brick wall be like exactly the same. I guess I'm just gonna throw a bathroom over here or something. <laughs> We're just gonna... Just gonna throw a bathroom in the corner here. There you go, bathroom. I'm just gonna throw a toilet in there. Apparently, we can't. I don't know if we can even put a sink in there. Can we? Can we afford a sink? Provides water for two employees. Okay, let's throw a sink in there, <laughs> and a toilet paper roll, paper holder. All right, what's it saying? Missing one. We have that already. All right. Requires a light level. Listen, guys, you have to. You have to have a light in order to be able to go to the bathroom. Otherwise, you just can't. I wish I could do like a top light. Like, what the frick is this all supposed to be? Um, I may have to actually move this down a little bit. Um, let's expand this bathroom a little bit more, I guess, because apparently that's not really big enough. I don't know how to get rid of stuff, though. That's the one thing. So, that's flooring. That's not helping me at all. Can I? Hold on left control it says is to delete okay so let's delete that wall there did i delete all the toilet too i the toilet's still there <laughs> the toilet is still there i'll throw the sink what's it saying i can't see right now 
Uh, am I still in demolition mode? I am not in de What is it doing? Oh, I, I guess I can't have more than two toilets? What is it saying? You know, I'm just going to put a door in here and just, just call it a freaking day at this point. I don't even know what's going on anymore. <laughs> I, I can't. Where's the... How do you put it? I saw the door thing earlier and I was like, what the frick? I don't need a door, do I? I'm just going to demolish this wall and just call it a day. Hold on. Can I... Oh, frick, it's giving me problems and I don't like it. There. There, have fun. All right, I'm done. I've had enough. There's a toilet there. If you don't want to use it, that's not my freaking problem at this point. All right, let's get back to business, all right? Designing this freaking engine. I'm going to speed this up. How far are we? I think we're like 37%. Okay, 37, 42. Ugh, it's going to take us some time now, isn't it? Yes, I should. Uh, they are mandatory. Listen, I have a restroom there. Uh, hard macro has taken policy decisions, which made a lot of gamers happy for the PC platform. An increase in popularity of the platform is expected. You know, to be honest, I can't really do anything right now because I'm still designing game engines. So, I mean, uh, it's annoying me. We have 398k, losing 129 dollars a month. We're like almost 80 percent through. The game exposition game developer congregation will begin in one month. Game developer congregation. This is a thing that we're doing. The game developer congregation has begun, and work on Symbios is done. It can now be used for game development. All right, so let's uh. Let's see. We've done the game and we've done the game engine. We've done I mean let's just start. I mean, we can start now, right? New game with our engine, Symbios game engine. Select price. Do we really know the uh let's just make it like $10. I don't even know what it's going to really be about yet. Uh fighting simulation sandbox. Let's just make it a simulation game. Uh it's just going to be hmm design new theme you must hire a designer to design new oh so that's how i would be able to probably get into what i was looking at before well for right now we're just going to start off with our very first game it's going to be urban we're going to make it uh teen platform pc uh it's just regular studio uh full game expansion pack oh you can make expansion packs i don't know what i'm going to call this at all urban sim i don't even know what urban simulation would be i'm going to call it the city all right, this is our first game. It's it's been a little bit of a <laughs> little bit of struggle for me so far to get this stuff going, but uh, the city it is. All right, so perspective, first person, third person. Uh, does it really matter? Let's do third person. Well, no, let's do let's do first person. First person, branching story, in depth backstories related skill writing i don't know what my character is really good at at all at this point though dialogue conversation system partially voice characters fully voice characters amateur voice acting oh my god can we get like full-blown like freaking actors in here like gary oldman doing uh what is it squad squad what is that game called that's coming out i can't even remember what it is now they have like freaking gary oldman and um i think it's uh also mark hamill <laughs> we could do something like that I think we'll do work amount 100 plus 60. Uh, let's just do... Let's do in-depth backstories. Dialogue, conversation system, partially voiced characters. We'll just do partially voiced characters. And then we'll do world design, basic world design, because that's all we can do. Gameplay, save game, uh, selectable difficulty, tips and hints, accurate gun mechanics. There aren't any guns in this game. I don't think they're well it's urban city game there may be some guns in there i don't know accurate gun mechanics uh we won't do accurate sword fighting accurate martial no uh let's just not do any of the rest of those realistic graphics let's do that uh 8-bit audio chip tune soundtrack good lord static ambient auto audio let's do a chip tune soundtrack we're gonna put in a decent amount of effort for this first game all right uh, select related game. There's a I can do a select uh, related game. There's nothing. So why can't I begin develop? No voiceover type. Where the where's the voiceover type? I thought I did that already. Did I miss something? Voiceover type partially, fully voiced voiceover type. I don't see this anywhere right now. Eight bit audio chip tune. I did that part. I hmm. 
I'm confused. Partially voice characters. Amateur. Oh, do I have to click this part? Oh, okay. What well, we're doing the freaking amateur voice acting. Alright, begin development. Here we go. I have no idea how long this is going to take. I really don't know how well my character is going to do with this either. No idea what the quality of this is going to be like at all. Game Developer Congregation has finished. And we are still here in our freaking 4x4 square of an office. Just typing away. I'm going to go ahead and speed this up some. It's still 1988. I think it's, uh... What's this? It's almost June now. It's now June. How far are we? Seven. Oh my god. We are... It's going to take us a while. Hopefully we can not... Uh, we can do this before we become broke. I'm assuming. Currently we're in the... Okay, wait. We're currently in the development stage. Next stage is polishing. How are we in... De we're in development already at like 16%. That seems fast. What was the first stage? Uh, platform popularity boost. Mega has taken policy decision which has made a lot of gamers happy for the Mega Origin platform. Increase in popularity platform is expected. Mega has released a new Origin game. There's a new console. How well are people um like looking at that right now? Like, can is there a way that I can tell? Office preferences projects. Uh, I think it was maybe when it, was it projects platforms. Here we go. Uh, so the Mega Origin now has 13% of the market share. PC, uh, percentage has fallen as well. Released in 1988 years ago. Hmm. Alright, well, back to what I was doing then. And at 5 speed. Currently 23% done. I still need to figure out this whole bathroom thing, because I haven't freaking figured that out yet. Uh, let's see if I can... No, that's not what I need to do. Uh, property and rivals, expand office... Uh, back over down to sanitary. Let's put this over. Okay, now I can place things again. I wouldn't put the toilet roll way over there. That doesn't really make sense now, does it? Uh, throw the sink. See, it wasn't letting me do this before. Maybe because I didn't have doors? I don't know. Uh, I think, what's it saying? I still need another light. Workplace can't share a room with the toilet. Okay, I guess that makes sense, you know? You're asking too much. Okay, I see the door feature now also. So let me go ahead and put the wall back up real quick. Plaster wall. And then I will uh, throw the door in there. It was right here, right? Why is general? Okay, it fits in general. It's a $20 door. Let me rotate this. I guess I'll throw it right there. We should have a bathroom now. It's still not enough light in here though for some freaking reason. Uh, let's just throw the light right there. I don't know why the lights are still on the floor. I can't really answer that one. But uh, now we have bathroom. <laughs> he just, yep, I'm just going to take a break, go to the bathroom, uh, and go back. It's now the year 1989. We've been developing this for like maybe six months. Because I know we started out with the game engine, so we technically didn't start with our first game, which kind of sucks for us. I wonder if these are like rival companies over here in these general in these offices. Or are these like offices that we can, there's people coming out of these. I was gonna say, like, where's everybody going? I was gonna say, maybe these are offices we can expand to. This is interesting. To see everything that's going on. How far does this map go? Okay, it doesn't go that far. Uh, Nintendo has just released their new Play and Go platform. What the frick? The Play and, the play and Go in, like, 1990? Come on. They are freaking ahead of the game now, aren't they? Look at them. We're 67% through. Uh, project can now be released. Your, your, the city game project can now be released. It's currently in its last polishing stage, which is optional, but can provide extra, qu extra quality points. We're gonna go ahead and just make sure that it gets done as, uh, as far as we can. I don't want to release a half-done freaking product. It's probably not gonna be that great anyway, but, uh, <laughs> just make it as good as we can for right now. We're gonna have to hire some new employees soon at some point, too. Uh... Oh, the Abacoxy SE is no longer supported. Pineapple is announced. Huh. We'll stay on the market for 12. See? See, these things are already dying off. I called this, did I not? I said PC is the future, okay? And PC will be one of the only things that will remain because all these other platforms will die off until freaking the knockoff version of Microsoft comes in and starts up the freaking Xbox. <laughs> yep. And then um, the knockoff Sony, probably going to be called like Brony or something, comes in to... Uh, set up the PlayStation. What do, okay, it's now been finished. We can now release it. Uh let's see. We can test, we can look for a publisher. 
advertise the game. Uh, game Engine V2 has been released. One notable feature of this game engine has racing wheel support, which is new tech. But yeah, our, our game engine kind of sucks, but, uh, you know, whatever. So, I think... So, let's... I guess we... Maybe we just announce the game, advertise the game. I guess we should have done that all that stuff earlier. So this is this is probably gonna be a flop. Let's look for a publisher. Uh, you shabby soft. <laughs> uh, game advance, UHQ. Uh, so maybe we're gonna have to release it by ourselves because we have to have a minimum amount of employees for this and a minimum reputation. So I guess maybe we just announce the game. What did that do? I don't think that did anything. Uh, the reveal was met by either a minimal amount of people or no one at all. Probably gained 14 points. Reveal score plus 136. So that that didn't help really at all. I don't even think we can actually uh, do anything with it. Like I don't even think we can actually release it because we can't we can't get a publisher. The overall quality I can't really tell what it was. Uh, the quality of the graphics is 207. Hmm. Our worst was the was the uh, dialogue, which sucked apparently really bad. <laughs> so, I guess we're just stuck. I don't really think that we can actually release this yet until we hire some more employees and get our reputation up. So we may be just sitting on this for quite some time. Uh, can I? Yeah, I can't. I can't even try and bully my way into this. Um, all right. Well. We have no reputation for anything. How do you gain reputation? Was I just supposed to be advertising in things? Let's advertise. Let's see what we can do. Uh, bribe reviewer. Mass advertisement. Let's do that. Oh my god. Wait, that's a lot of money. Never mind. Forget that. Invite for an interview. Uh, IGM. <laughs> which I guess is IGN. Let's do... We have the best chance for legit reviews. So let's see if they would like to come over. Uh, I will be answered in a couple days. So there's no guarantee that they're actually gonna do it. Uh, we'll gladly come check the city out. Expect us in three days. Okay, so in a couple days they will be here to check out the game. Here's in what you're making an urban simulation game, which is definitely an interesting combination. What can you tell us about it? We think it'll be great fun. We'll let the players decide. No, uh, fans would like to know how soon will they? We don't know yet. You will soon find out. We'll just do that. People would like to know what aspect of the game are you focused on the most? the story people are always on the lookout for great games is there any is there anything additional you'd like to mention in regards to the game we don't want to it'll be a fun ride uh you you end the interview with a smile on your face confident that it went well no hands-on interview score of 190 interview has increased the expectations for the city reputation gained 12 popularity gained 180 okay so that still didn't help our reputation is like six all right but i'm gonna end it here guys and I will see you in the next one once I figure out how to actually get our freaking reputation up. <laughs>